there have been several calls for the judiciary to sit and decide the true winner of the 2023 presidential election before the inauguration of the president's elect on May 29th. The senior advocate of Nigeria, Femi Falano, has also shared his opinion on the matter. The Lega Eagle, speaking in an interview with Arise TV News, explained that the two major things to major things the court need is the report from IREV and the Beavers. He clarified that the petition doesn't have to last for six months and stipulate, as stipulated in the Constitution. He argued that when these laws were set up, nobody knew that the Beavers technology and the electronic transmission of results will occur. According to him, Nigeria will have to replicate what Ghana and Kenya had done in setting their election matters before the inauguration. He stated clearly that there's a need for a reform and for election petitions to be taken directly to the Supreme Court. He said, in most other African countries, you have a constitutional court. This petition goes straight to the constitutional court, and this court takes only 14 days to conclude the operations. At the time the constitution provided for six months, nobody knew we are going to have the use of a, a beaver's machine or transmission of election results to the central server of IREV. For me, if you have the reports of the beaver's machine that has captured the election and the results that have been uploaded to the IREV, if you have the, this or those two things, the election petition can be decided in 14 days. It doesn't have to last for six months. <laughs> yes, when I hear people say, oh, why now? Why are they saying that uh, the court should decide before any inauguration? Because as uh, things begin to change every now and then, the question is that those two countries that uh, Fallon cited, they were doing things the way they were doing it before they had to change it. So why is it that uh, they don't say, oh, let us just continue? As new things begin to come and you begin to like, oh, there are some amendments and whatever you really need to do and all of that. Well, if they are not going to do it now, that means it is something that uh, we need that needs to be done in the future. That is the way it ought to be. Do you know who scattered this whole thing? Mm -hmm. It is the same INEC. When you say you are going to do this, so you expect people not to take you serious. Because some people are saying, oh, that was not what they agreed upon. That was not what the constitution said. That was not what the law says. What did this? I don't really understand. INEC should be forced to provide the beavers and high ref to settle the election matter. Buhari APC defending the sham that just passed in the name of elections. That is why they don't want to prevail on INEC to do the needful. Then, with this, Tinubu won the election. Very simple. <laughs> okay. It is the tribunal that has the power to compel INEC to provide the needed items, but they will not because of selfishness. Very simple thing to end all this stress. You won't see any APC talk about these beavers or IREF results. They uploaded. INEC said they don't have a results. They don't have the results. They announced again. You see the type of country... We are into the military should arrest Mahmoud hmm, Yakubu and beat hell out of his memories to provide beavers and IRA resort. This is the bad news, of course, for the APC and Tinubu. Okay. Well, eh, I really uh, listen to Falano and some of his partisan colleagues. This this because their comments are not consistent with the constitution and their previous stance. That's are this to influence of money, jealousy and selfishness. If you not say uh, if you know how Falano say the tribunal can finish off within 14 days as if it's a case of two fighting. This is a case where there are many issues in contention and defense will be called. Please stop playing to the gallery. Revisit Mr. Falano uh, stand if you have the uploaded results from the two portals. The judgments can be delivered in two weeks. Absolutely with sense of duty, purpose, patriotism, and urgency. <laughs> this uh, impasse can be resolved in few days, but the rogue elements, I say, the rogue elements that are behind this, this old fraud, we want the process to last 
10 years or even years on end. <laughs> well, instead of hiring sons and dozens of lawyers, why don't INEC just provide the beavers and IREP data? Not having it is the reason that it can even be decided in a week. After all, why did we spend whooping over 300 billion era in an election if not for the associated thick? Yakubu and Einek know everything, know very well what they have done and are going to any extent or length, no matter the length and height to cover up their shame. The girls carried away with their bias and ended up cheats in broad daylight in the market square. That is even too much. <laughs> Some are even saying that's a 14 days is even too much. That two days, if they are serious about the whole thing, if they are serious about it, once a presumed president elects his son, he and his ministers will do everything they can to legit legalize their illegitimate mandates by the court of law and i'm very sure they will succeed in doing so the judiciary should realize that all eyes are on them we have no other country than nigeria <laughs> if they do the right thing it is for the good of all of us but if they come up with such absurdity or uluwole judgments that enthrone an election rigor as a governor in Imo state posterity we never forgive them their entire families will never know peace if they do the wrong thing. And you think all these ones are patriotic? They are, uh, they are patriotic Nigerians. They always concerned. They are only concerned about what happens to them. You think anybody? All these ones are they care that whether you have not eaten two times a day, or whether you don't have money to put uh, or food to put on your table, or you don't have money to pay your children's school fees, or you cannot move from one point to another safely. In as much they have everything. At their, their own back and con, you think they, they reason you. They don't care about this Nigeria. Is it even a boy that you say he cares about Nigeria? With all the mantra of a, I will fight corruption, I will do this, I will do that. Nibolo just said, Lorira, where did he end? You see that man so, you know, so, so unserious. It's not just serious about the country. Ah. A, a president have been president that is just all what he came to do it's so it's so 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 bad they don't care they don't care whether you you breathe or not they don't care whether you live or not in as much their own corner is well loaded that's all life moves on life continues you know how to manage yourself that is why they are rolling in this matter manner so guys let's say your opinion and have your take on this